this is a question that we wonder all the time, and I feel like maybe you would know it. S- net worth. When you look up somebody's net worth online, yeah. is it accurate or no. is it not accurate? No, 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 no. no. It's not? Never. It never? Never. Is. I've heard that I've been worth a billion, and yeah. I am far from a billion yeah. and I've been heard, I've heard that I went bankrupt yeah. and I've <laughs> yeah. never been bankrupt right so I look at the general ones and people are lazy today they just go on and look at what was last posted somewhere right it's so, like the top thing that pops up on Google yeah exactly so if, you, if you're somebody and you want to lie and be like oh, I'm worth 100 million you put that in some kind of statement right. someplace they're going to say you're worth 100 million dollars right and that's and a lot of people learn that that's bad because the IRS gets up their ass and then they <laughs> go wait a minute I didn't have that money and then all of a sudden they don't even have money to pay other mm-hmm. things, and then they're in trouble. Yeah, and then you're in jail. Yeah, and then yeah. you end up like Mike the situation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who's then free then, now? then they're they're you definitely have a problem. Um, we like Rhea said, we do love watching Shark Tank. Do you, are there products that you did not invest in that you have seen maybe become successful that you regretted not investing in? Yes and no. So I, I have not invested. No. So yeah. first of all. Um, I have seen products that went off and become successful. Like yeah. the, the the one that's got the, been the biggest that nobody invested in was Ring, and that right. sold for 1.2 billion to Amazon. My but parents Jamie, got a Ring. Yeah, and <laughs> I went too. And, and you know what? After actually after they uh, pitched, I went and bought 20 of them for all my friends and family. So yeah. I love the product. But even Jamie said he was asking too much at the time. Jamie, who was the owner of the company. Yeah. And then I'll see stuff like uh, I always talk about this little pin that came on um, that you know you put in your shirt so it could hold your your reading glasses. And uh, you know, as a designer, I've been making little holes in um, uh, shirt pockets in Tommy Bahama for years to put your glasses. In. So I said it's going to be garbage. Right. Lori goes and does ten million dollars worth of this crap. She sells. It t- <laughs> she's the flea market. She is yeah. the flea market she of Shark Tank. She knows what she's doing. But the reality is, she knew that she was selling reading glasses for fifteen years on QVC, so she had a bunch of people ready for this item. So it really is the right shark with the right product, meaning the right mm-hmm. uh, owners of the company. Is yeah. there ever contention between the sharks? Like you wanted a product and they got it. Yeah. No, absolutely. Really. It actually it, happens. It happens yeah. all the time. Actually. Um, uh, we get over it right after that pitch because there's another pitch that comes mm-hmm. in the door. But, you know, first of all, you know, uh, you're getting in between me and making a deal, right? I can't go and crap on the entrepreneur because I want to be that person's partner. I don't want them to feel like crap. So you're insulting me on national television. Plus, you know, you, you're making everybody feel like uh, you're smarter. And so, so yeah, we get yeah. in between it. Yeah. I will say I actually do love those episodes. I mean, when we fight? Just, yeah, as a viewer, yeah, like watching you guys fight, yeah, it's entertaining. I try to egg them on. I'm in the middle going, yeah. shark, fight, <laughs> yeah, shark, yeah. fight, That's shark, That's what I love. Fight. I mean, it keeps the viewers entertained, and that mixed with the pitches, it's like the best show yeah. ever. Yeah, I it's like, nothing like seeing Robert bristle up at a, at a, at a nasty comment. Right. It, it, is, it is very fun to watch. I actually had a, um, a, a good friend go on Shark Tank. He, I, yeah. you, unfortunately, you were not on the panel during okay. his episode, but he was with his two brothers. They have a coffee drink. It's like a protein uh-huh. coffee drink. It's called Super Coffee. And uh, they did not get an offer, and I was so uh-huh. sad. <laughs> oh my God, I was so sad. But there are three like, very attractive young uh-huh. brothers, and so like they they like went viral on social media. But also, Barbara, Barbara wasn't on the panel either, was she? <laughs> she no, was. She was. She was. They, they were like right? they, they were flirting a little bit. Talk, yeah. Barbara. Oh, she's a... I know they were. They. It was so funny because I talked to them after, and they were like, "We really thought we had Barbara." Yeah, she's, <laughs> yeah. a, she's a straight perp. Yeah. But I think she mustache, <laughs> trench coat, lollipop. She got it all Love down. To hear like, it. She's full out. Yeah, I think yeah. she just you know toyed with them a little bit. Yeah, and yeah, was like, yeah, I'm out. Yeah, she's just teasing them a little bit. That's fine. Yeah. Um, That's funny. We have to ask you this because we're big fans of Selena Gomez and she's big fans of Shark Tank. Yeah. Were you there when she... I was not. I oh, just oh. left that day. Um, I heard she stayed on set the entire day. Um, they said that she was, uh, you know, watching. You, you get to watch the monitor behind. Right. And um, <laughs> after, you know, after you see a couple of pictures or an hour, hour and a half, you're like, oh, it's, oh, wait a minute. This is, you know, this is actually real business. And they said she was glued to the monitor in the back and uh, they had to kind of like drag around her friends like, come on, all right, let's go, let's yeah, go. Yeah. So, so really sweet. Oh. Really, really is, sweet. Um, is that like the most shocking cele- or celebrity that you found out like is a fan? Like is there, is have you ever heard of people who are like, we love Shark Tank and it's somebody you would have never guessed or? Yeah. I- Sure, there's a lot. Yeah. I mean, I went to, uh, I got invited uh, by his wife. I went into um, uh, Phil Collins' concert the other night. Oh, wow. and Phil was like, 
That's all I do is sit home and watch Shark Tank. <laughs> yeah, and, um, like, that's not what I want to guest to either. Uh, yeah, I'm not. <laughs> you know what? It actually, she's my partner now. But one day I got a call. I, it was on my website. It was, uh, you know, I want to talk to you. And this was, uh, I, I looked at the name. I said, is this Catherine Zeta-Jones? I was like, <laughs> you're talking about Catherine Zeta-Jones from Brooklyn? You know, the one that I that I knew? Uh, they were like, no, 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 the real Catherine yeah. Zeta-Jones. <laughs> I was like, all right, I call her up. She's like, yeah, me and Michael, we lay in the bed every Friday night and just watch Shark Tank. We And I was like, Catherine Zeta-Jones and Michael Douglas? Yeah, are you, yeah, are you yeah. kidding me? And she's like, yeah, really. So I'm, 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 uh, I'm never surprised and I'm happily surprised mm -hmm. by a lot yeah. of the people that, that watch the show. Yeah. That is amazing. That's unbelievable. And I'm sure there's way more that totally. watch that you yeah. don't even know. Totally. Yeah. So yeah. that's amazing.